Good day, Charlie Hart here with the Market Report for the 3rd of July 2018. 2,600 cattle gunned up after uh, 2,200 last week, so up a bit. Uh, a lot of better cattle, cattle through the market. I thought uh, some crop cattle starting to be yarded, which was um, out of obviously out of only a few selected areas, but uh, some of those cattle sold particularly well. Market stronger right the way through. Bulls uh, up to 48, so 248 the top bull, which is a fair bit better than last week uh, for a B muscle bull. Um, plenty of bulls making 230s, which is an improvement. Cows, uh, once again, stronger on the top end. Best cow up to 228, uh, but lots of cows that I would have thought would have made 140 or 50, making 160 or 70. So, once again, stronger market through the middle part of the cows. Uh, yearling job, quite a bit better. Um, heavy feeders, deers, uh, up over three bucks several times, up to 310 for those sort of 440 kilo cattle, which is um, a good result in the yards. Uh, the lighter feeder cattle, uh, a touch over three dollars for your steers, for the better ones, um, and two, up to 290, 295 for your heifers. So that was the top end of it. There's still plenty of cattle making uh, slightly below that, but um, you know, good results through there. Wieners also stronger. Uh, steer wieners I saw make 305 for your sort of 250 or 60 kilo uh, steer wieners, the top of that job, and uh, heifers sort of making up to 240 and 50 for the best of them. Still plenty making 220s and 30s. So right the way through, an improvement. Um, but then again, the yarding was probably better than the week before, um, which helped, of course. Rain was disappointing, although north of Bingra and up through Inverell to Glenys was pretty substantial rain, which would have helped some crops. But uh, through the sort of Gunnedah, Baraba, Tamworth area, nothing to report that would have helped much. Uh, anyway, market better. Uh, sheep and lambs extremely strong everywhere. So give us a call for any livestock marketing advice um, and I'll catch you next week.